Hello everyone, welcome to our YouTube channel GKR Soft. In this video, we are going to discuss about ASPICE process capability levels. In our previous video, we discussed about ASPICE overview. I have mentioned the link in the description. You can watch it. First, we can start with what is ASPICE. ASPICE is nothing about it is an automotive software process improvement and capability determination. And ASPICE is based on ISO. 15504. So ASPICE is a set of guidelines and best practices for software development and system engineering processes in the automotive industry. In ASPICE 3.0, it has three process groups. One is primary life cycle process, another one is organization life cycle process and another one is supporting life cycle process. In our previous video, we deeply discussed about these three life cycle processes. I have mentioned the link in the description. You can watch it. ASPICE defines six process capability levels, which are used to evaluate the maturity of processes and the effectiveness of organization approach to process management. And these levels are designed to help organizations continuously improve their processes to meet industry standards and regulatory requirements. Now we can discuss about each and every level. First, we can start with level zero. It is named as incomplete, meaning no process is followed in level 0. And here, the process is not defined or is completely ineffective. There is no evidence of process performance or capability. Level 1 is named as performed. It is also called as basic process. So, the process is performed in an ad hoc and reactive manner in level 1. The basic activities are in place, but there is no consistency or long term planning in level 1. And the process may be carried out without clear documentation, but there is at some level of activity and results are generated in level 1. However, it lacks systematic management and consistency in level 1. Level 2 is named as managed, so managed process in level 2. The process is planned, performed and monitored and controlled in level 2 and there is evidence of defined procedure and consistent execution in level 2. In level 3 is named as established. So meaning here we have a defined process. So the process is well defined, documented and understood by the organization in level 3. So it is integrated into the organization overall management process. Next one is level 4. It is named as predictable. So meaning here quantitatively managed process. So the process is quantitatively managed and optimized based on data driven decisions in level 4. So performance is measured and controlled in a predictable manner in level 4. The next one is level 5. It is named as optimizing. So meaning it is continuous improvement. The process is continuously improved based on a quantitative understanding of the system. So in level 5, it is proactively managed and optimized through innovation. So these all are the ASPICE process capability levels. Next one is how ASPICE process capability levels are used. Here we have a three methods. One is ASPICE assessment, that means process assessment. Another one is improvement roadmap and supplier evaluation. In process assessment, ASPICE levels are used to assess the maturity of specific processes in the development of automotive software and systems. So in process management, organization may undergo an assessment to determine where they stand on ASPICE scale and identify areas of improvement. Next one is improvement roadmap. So organization can use the ASPICE levels as a roadmap for continuous improvement moving from level 1 to level 5. The next one is supplier evaluation. So here automotive OEMs often use ASPICE to evaluate their supplier processes. Whether supplier to meet the higher ASPICE level are often preferred because they demonstrate a higher level of process maturity, reliability and capability to deliver quality products. Hope you have a clarity about ASPICE process capability levels. Thanks for your time. Thanks for watching this video. If you like it, please subscribe our channel. Thank you so much. Have a nice day.